I hope you're all well. So it's Wednesday the 10th of January. I'm actually making my breakfast because I am freezing and I'm just going to have something warm for breakfast today. So I was just looking in the cupboards and I saw I still had one of these quick oats and simple protein porridge sachets. So I'm going to have one of those with milk and I'm going to weigh an apple as well just to start off my five day. Um, but yeah, if you are new, hello and welcome. My name is Katie and this is my weight loss journey. I do calorie counting with Nutri Check and my weigh day is Monday. So yeah, I just plotted in that. I'm just going to weigh out the milk in a minute. Um, yeah, that's it really. I'm not doing much today. Um, I'll nip out quickly this morning. But other than that, nothing exciting. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to make my porridge. I'll confirm the calories once I've weighed out my milk. Um, yeah, so I hope everyone is having a great, for if it's your first week back on your weight loss journey, if you're trying to lose weight, um, I hope you're having a great first week. Um, I just hate this cold. I was just saying to the taxi, um, can't wait till we go to Spain. <laughs> so, yeah, that is really keeping me motivated at the moment. So, yeah, I'm going to go because my battery needs to be changed and I'll come back to confirm the calories of my breakfast in a minute. So, this is going to be my breakfast. Very different for the last couple of days, but this is just 301 calories altogether. So it's the Quaker Oats So Simple Golden Syrup Protein Porridge Sachet, uh, 173 grams of semi skim milk, and the apple weighed 138 grams as well. So a nice warming breakfast with some fruits to start off my five a day for 301 calories altogether. Hi guys. So again, it's not been probably the best day, obviously, for meals. Um, I helped my friend out again with another appointment that she had, uh, a physio appointment. So I went to that and I had a bacon sandwich while I was out, which I tracked, and I believe it was 450 calories. So I've had that. I'm about to make my second cup of coffee, which is already been plotted in, and it's just. Me and Louise tonight, Adam has um, Paul, was it Paul or Snooper? I think it's Snooper tonight. <laughs> um, he plays for a Snooper team on an odd occasion and then his local pool team is on Thursdays. So tonight he's actually got Snooker. So just me and Louise tonight, so I might even have just one of the um, calorie controlled ready meals, which I got two out yesterday. Just for in case like so I'm glad I've done that um but yeah so that would probably be my tea so that would keep me on track um so yeah just making my coffee and I will try not to yawn because I made a couple of you yawn yesterday <laughs> um so yeah I'm gonna warm up now and I will come back to you my tea i might even make this into a two-day vlog because obviously it's quite short today but um you'll know obviously from when i upload but yeah so i'm gonna make my coffee and i'll come back to you with what i decide to have for my tea all right so it's just come 25 past five so if i have got around to make myself some to eat so i'm having this calorie controlled Spaghetti bolognese for 351 calories. I've put some cheese on it. It's Tesco uh, medium cheddar and I put 10 grams on weighed. And this in total was 393 calories altogether. So obviously not much fruit or fetch today, but um, still on track so far for today. But yes, that's going to be my tea. Hi guys, so have my bolognese. It's really, really nice. Um, I don't think I'm going to have anything else because I don't know, I've got a bit of a belly ache. I don't think it's because I left it so long in between meals. Um, and obviously my body's still getting used to like not having as much food. So yeah, I think I'm just going to leave it for now. Um, and this is going to roll over and be a two day vlog. So 
I will speak to you first thing tomorrow morning. And yeah, I'm going to go chill tonight. As I said, I've got to watch a new book. But I'm going to chill my new book that I started today. I'm going to go to bed. And I will see you in the morning. Yes. Hi guys, so it's now Thursday, the 11th of January. So I've actually got Louie home today because the passenger assistant isn't very well. And if anyone finds like a last minute like passenger assistant for like today. So I'm hoping they'll find him for tomorrow because I actually had stuff to do today. <laughs> so um yeah, but it's just gone nine, ten past nine. I just made my breakfast, I just made my wheat biscuits with fruit and yogurt. So I just got two of the Asda chocolate wheat biscuits today. And 80 grams of blueberries, the Arla protein yogurt, and 90 grams of strawberries. So breakfast today is going to be 380 calories. And yeah, so I've got a fun filled day at home with Louis. So I'm going to eat this because I'm actually feeling quite peckish. And I'll come back to you for lunch at home today because obviously I'm not going anywhere. So I'll speak to you then. Oh God, so it's now half twelve, so this is what I'm having for lunch. It is 483 calories altogether. So it's a small tin of the Asda baked beans and sausages. I actually weighed it out and it was 208 grams, so not, where is it? Not 215 grams, like it states on the tin. Uh, I've got some of Tesco medium cheddar cheese on there, an apple for after, and it's Neville's homer bread. So that's what I'm going to have for my lunch. 483 calories all day. Hello. Let's sort of pop on. It's gone to 3 o'clock. And have my coffee. I'm going to read some of my book now. I haven't been able to be as productive today because obviously Louis has been home, but I can't have that. I am still waiting. I just want to check my emails quickly. If. They've managed to get a passenger assistant for tomorrow. Nobody rang me yet. She did say she was going to update me today and it's three o'clock, so she hasn't got long. But, um, yeah, so fingers crossed that we can go to school tomorrow. But yeah, so I'm going to have a little chill time and read my book I just started yesterday. Um, but yeah, so a bit of a Maybe slower day, I suppose. But um, yeah, I'm feeling a bit tired because I stay up a little bit later last night to help my friend Kirsty with the Unit Three assessment on our course that we're doing. So I have a bit of a late night off site, but it was all fine. And it was glad I could help. So yeah, I think I've decided I'm going to have the other calorie controlled ready meal for my tea tonight just just for ease while I haven't been tired today but um tomorrow I'll get back to cooking properly <laughs> um but yeah so overall obviously still on track um but yes yeah, so I'm going to chill out now for a bit and then I'll come back to you to confirm the calories for my tea. Hi guys just hold pop on it's just gone five so I'm just finishing making my loose tea uh, I'm just doing uh, really just want some chicken dippers, ch chicken dippers and chips tea. I'm just gonna have this carbonara tea, but I'm actually gonna make it a little bit high calorie and a little bit bougie. I'm gonna try and make some garlic bread. <laughs> like, I know it's easy to buy some, but I've still got these Morbid soft pitters to use, so I'm gonna try and cut it open. And then I'm going to make a little garlic butter, spread it on, and then I'm going to put it in, try and put it in the air fryer for a little um, couple of minutes to warm for it in the toast. So I've got four butter, which I'm going to measure out, and then I'm just going to mix in some garlic powder and some of these Italian herbs that I've got. Make it into a little butter, spread it on. Um, put it in the air fryer and see how it goes. I just thought it, it makes it a little bit high calorie, but it's using my calories on things to make the meal a bit more filling, like I said. 
So, yeah, just waiting for little bits to finish in the air fryer, and then I will start making my makeshift garlic bread. <laughs> um, so, yeah, um, just thought I'd let you know my little update, and I'll show you it once it's all ready. So, what I've done so far is I've weighed out some butter, put it in this bowl. I've got 21 grams of butter in there, I think that should be plenty. Then all I'm actually going to do is season it to how I think. Oops, <laughs> how I think it will be good. Um, and um, I might even put my cheese. I know you can't see me. Um, I might even put my uh, cheese that I've uh, pre-plotted in to. Um, on top of the garlic bread. So all I'm actually going to do is mix it together into like a paste and spread it on. I've kind of split the soft pepper and then all I'm actually going to do is spread it on there, put it in the air fryer for a minute or two till it melts and see what we come out with. So I will show you it all dished up in a minute. And there it is. I think I could probably have toasted the pitta before putting anything on, um, but it smells absolutely delicious. So it's just this Hello controlled spaghetti carbonara. There's 20 grams of cheese in total. There's some on the, the carbonara and some on the garlic bread. It's just a Walton's wholemeal soft pitta with floral light butter, as you saw, and the garlic powder and Italian herbs. So I don't think for a makeshift, garlic bread with using stuff that we've got in um it looks too bad so i will let you know the verdict once i've eaten it and yeah spoon made a little um ready meal a little bit more bougie so yeah i will catch up with you in a bit all right so I have my tea uh that's actually really very really nice so obviously it was just a quick way to zhuzh up a ready meal and yeah it was really, really nice i think next time if i do that again which i probably will is i'll probably pre-toast the pitta a little bit first and then it might go a bit more crispy in the air fryer when i put the butter and the cheese on so yeah i really really enjoyed that vampires will be keeping away from me tonight i can tell you that <laughs> um so I don't think I'm going to have anything else. Like, I'm trying to get into that mindset again of not eating something else after my dinner just because I can have a pudding or a treat afterwards. Uh, so I do feel relatively satisfied by the meal and having the little garlic bread. So I have got 141 calories left. And I've actually nearly drank a litre of... I know I'm not at my full goal yet, but um, the flavoured water that I got from Tesco, I got two bottles. I put one in the Stanley Cup that I've got. Um, I'm currently using Adam's green one because I've put the seasonal ones away. <laughs> um, so yeah, and a whole one of those fits in this cup. So a whole litre fits in there. So I, I think I'm about three quarters of the way through. So obviously eventually I'll get back into get used to drinking two litres of water again. But yeah, so I hope you don't mind that I've put these two days together. And tomorrow I'll be back. Hopefully Louis back to school. Um and back to having something I'm gonna might try and make like a fake way for tea tomorrow. I'll see how I feel. Got some chicken that needs using. Um, or pasta bake, could do a pasta bake again, make some garlic bread. Um, but I'll see how I feel tomorrow and see what the day brings. So, if you did enjoy this video, please don't forget to leave a big thumbs up. If you are brand new, hello and welcome, please hit that subscribe button. I'm trying my hardest to grow my channel, and I'll speak to you tomorrow whenever we'll eat today. Take care, bye.